OK, so we've drawn our rectangle and we've offset two other rectangles now to create the basic framework for our title block. Now, these three rectangles are polylines. If you hover over them, AutoCAD will tell you that they're a polyline and you'll notice there they're on the layer title block, which is where we want them to be. Now, let's just look at this in a little bit more detail. They are one whole object. Now, I don't want that to be a whole object or that to be a whole object. However, I do want the outline of the sheet, the actual drawing sheet itself, to be a polyline. I don't want that to change. What we can do here is we can utilize the explode command and the erase command. So, we can explode our rectangles here into their original four lines by using this command here, the explode command on the modify panel. So we click on explode. And as you can see there, it breaks a compound object into its component objects. So I click on Explode, come into the drawing area. I'm going to select this rectangle here and this rectangle here. I press Enter to confirm, and that's it. They don't look any different. However, if you use the highlighting tool in AutoCAD and hover over them, look, they've been broken down into their component lines. So they were a compound object a polyline, they're now component objects, they're all lines. So now I need to utilize the erase command to erase the lines that I don't need. So, again the modify panel here on the home tab, modify and there looks like a pencil with an eraser on the end. If I click on erase, that will allow me to use the pick box to select objects that I want to remove from this particular drawing. I want to remove this line here, so I left click on it with the pick box, this line here, left click on it with the pick box, and this line here, left click on it with the pick box. I press enter to confirm, and those lines now have disappeared. They've been taken off the drawing, they've been erased. But, let me just show you something here that's a little bit quicker. If I undo that, and bring those lines back by clicking on undo there on the quick access toolbar, I can literally go one, two, three with no command selected and press delete on the keyboard that will also erase those lines let me undo it one more time I'll select the lines again one and two and three left clicking on each one I can also right click and use erase on the shortcut menu so there's three ways of erasing those lines you can use any of those methods it doesn't matter find the one that you're comfortable with so that you can erase objects from your AutoCAD drawing effectively.